Luke chapter 4, verse 18 to 19. The Spirit of the Lord is on me. Because He has anointed me to proclaim the good news to the Lord. He has sent me to proclaim freedom to the prisoners and recovery of the and to set the oppressed free. Now, one more and put every day on a solo, may you be free. To proclaim the year of the Lord's favor. Now, men can't only be any more cheer home as some because the Spirit of God is upon his answer. Now, only a mission so conquer a woman so to be able to proclaim the Lord's favor. Sadia Beka, when you're any more cheer home as seven. We must enable ourselves to become custodian of God's presence. Until we have the presence of God, we cannot do that which He has called us to do. We cannot set the oppressed free if we do not have the Spirit of God working in us. So now we are praying that we will commit ourselves to the leadings guidance and the directions of the spirit in all we will be obedient unto the spirit we will be obedient unto the spirit we will not lead the spirit the spirit rather will lead us we will not guide the spirit the spirit will rather guide us we will not direct the spirit the spirit will rather direct us let us lift our voice and pray for obedience unto the spirit 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 that we will be saved to <laughs> Savior, we want to bless you this morning for the overflow of your spirit. Yes, Lord, we know he that has become the good thing will bring you to a perfect end. Therefore, we believe that everything that we have started in our life, you, God of heaven, will give us success in knowing you, in operating in the higher dimensions of your reality. In living in obedience unto your spirit. In Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Amen. Amen.